If you are editing in a vertical resolution for TikTok, Instagram, YouTube Shorts, and you are struggling to keep your subjects in the middle of the frame, then you have to know that now in DaVinci Resolve 18, there is a very, very cool trick on how it's done automatically. It's called Smart Reframe. It's really good. Let me show you how it works. Here I am in DaVinci Resolve. This is my clip I want to add Smart Reframe to. But, uh, you know, as you can see, this is in a 16 by 9 uh, resolution timeline. I'm going to go quickly and change it to a vertical one. Go to this gear icon over here, click on it, and then go to Timeline Resolution and toggle Vertical Resolution on. Boom. Save. Here we are straight away. We are in a vertical resolution. And if I play this clip, you can see that it looks pretty, pretty good, but at the end, our subject disappears. In order to fix this, what you have to do, you have to go here on the right top corner. You see Inspector, toggle Inspector on, go to Video, and under the video you will see Smart Refrain. Just click on it, and then you will see Object of Interest. It's either Auto or, let me click here, Reference Point. It depends how you want to use it. Most of the time I'll use reference point because here obviously we don't really know like because it's the subject is so small so we have to uh, help DaVinci Resolve identify our subject. Okay, so you have to go and click on this square over here as a target square. Okay, and then obviously you can make this bigger, larger, smaller and then I'm going to go and drag it on our person. But you go and make sure that you know you have to show it once just like this and then go to reframe and then DaVinci Resolve is going to analyze the clip and let's see how it looks like now okay it starts from here and then it tracks pretty pretty well and the person is perfectly in frame absolutely incredible it's so so cool and this is it really and then you have to go and press on this again and then you see you don't you don't see this icon over here go you see it's just smart reframe go to transform if you want to if you want to make this bigger or smaller and you can see DaVinci Resolve actually created some keyframes but it created the keyframes automatically in order to keep this person in center frame so if you want now to make it bigger or smaller DaVinci Resolve will still keep all this keyframes there go again press on transform and it's going to get rid of those keyframes. Pretty incredible. And this is how easy it is to keep one person in center frame. Absolutely incredible. Thanks so much for watching guys. I really appreciate you being here. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you found some, you know, value out of it. And if you did, please give it a thumbs up, consider subscribing and I will catch you guys in the next one. Take care. Happy creation. Bye bye.